Good morning. This is January 9th, 2021. Floss tube number six, if I remember right. And let's see there. I've been busy this week, or this last week. And I've got lots of half a million. So I ordered this back in December. And it's from Be Stitch Me because I, I love her fabrics. And it's Atlantis, Ada, Opal, and it's 18 count. Now, I originally ordered this for the uh, Dark Queen of the Seas stitch line. But then I made my own. So now I get to pick out another mermaid one, which the newest Millibera, Bella, is that how you say it? Sorry if I mispronounce things, I'm known for it. Um, is two mermaids together. I'm thinking about getting it once I have a little credit and not in the hole in my debt on my budget. And do it on this but I got it I ordered this in December so it's not on my budget at all <laughs> not no more okay then right I ordered this last month or so I think last month it might have been in December too I can't remember but I absolutely love this one Bella Trucks, Tricks, how you say it, and this fabric that I got a while back, oh, it's not showing good, but this is the fabric I am thinking about doing it on, so yeah. let's try it like that. What do y'all think? I think it's going to be beautiful. But <clears throat> hopefully I get started soon. But I was so happy to get that in. Then, yes, I spent some on Friday night fight night for Be Stitch Me. And I won three. And... So yes, my collection of fabric is growing, but I've got so many projects I want to do, and I want to have the pretty fabric for them. Sorry, I did not open this before. Okay, let's get away with the plastic. Okay, so this is one. This is a Ada, 18 by 21, 18 count. It's a little cloudy here today, so it don't want to show right. But this is absolutely gorgeous. And I think I want to put a fairy on it. Okay, I love fairies. But I got that one. And let's see. Ah. I hate these papers, but they do protect them so good. Okay, this is, same thing, this is Ada, 18 by 21, and it's 18 count. 18 count is my favorite. This is Von Dyke. Isn't it gorgeous? Then, fast crinkle, I hope. Because I know it has to get loud for some people. And this is my favorite, I think, out of the three. It's Ada again. 18 by 21. It's opal. 18 count. And it's purples. Purples are my favorite. You know what? Where is that pattern? How would that look? Oh, 
I like that. I like that. Okay, I might have changed my mind. It might not be the pinkish purple. I might go with this purple. Okay, y'all give me your opinion. Should it be top or bottom for this pattern? The top or the bottom? Just tell me which one. I like both. I really like both. <laughs> okay, now, I'm wanting, well, let, my happy planner. I'm still finding my way with my crafting page. So I wrote everything down twice, that's okay. But this is the one I use every, make every day count. And then like for this week, I put all the homework on the bottom. All the homework that I want for the month and all. And then as I go through, I will mark it off. And then next week, I will copy it on to the next week of what I don't have done. And I'm hoping to see some progress on it as soon as I get done with the quilted blanket. Um, yesterday, I got 475 stitches in. I normally do between 300 and 700 stitches a day. It depends on when I start in the day. <clears throat> And I love stitching. I love crocheting, which that's something I gotta show you. But this week's homework for magical stitches, I'm not matching up to the uh, prompt. I'm using uh, their pill and tea this year is stitching on your oldest project, which I am trying hard to get done. <laughs> And that is the Savannah quilt. And this is how much I got done last week. It was a blank square. So I got quite a bit done. And this is the last square. So this week's three tasks, each is 400 stitches. So that's 1,200 stitches. I'm hoping to have all of the lion done and like the rest up here. I'm gonna start doing it today. So I started that. Um, last week, I got all of the prompts using my oldest whip. And then for the extra credit, I used uh, Queen of the Dark Seas. That's another one I am trying. No, baby, baby, it's just burp. It's just burnt. It's okay. She barks at everything. Everything. But anyway, um, Dark Queens of the Seas, I'm wanting to get caught up with everybody. I just started it. But I got part two done. Well, I thought I had part two done. I got to do that one. I'll, I'll do that this weekend, though. But, um... I got, for this weekend, I worked on the Dark Queen of the Seas. And I finished all of part two. Because I only had fishies and a little bit down here. But I finished all of part two. Besides the outlining, right there and there. And then, yesterday, I worked on this one also. Because I wanted to finish part two. Well, I finished the part two. And I started part three. And I was so worried about this hand going down to touch the fish because I know so many had trouble with it. So that was the second color I started doing. And as you see, perfect. And this is the fabric I dyed myself. And I'm loving how it's turning out on here. Loving it. So this weekend, I will finish... Well, for the extra credit for Magical Stitches, I got the first two done. And now I'm just working on Medusa. So I've already got over 500 stitches for Medusa. And uh, 
so another thousand and then it'd be done and then i'm gonna work on the cabins i think which is uh the it's another stitch long that's the one i'm using for that stitch long <sighs> okay so that's it on that and that's all i accomplished was working on the lion and dark queens I tend to stick with one or two projects in a week because I get to see more progress and I want to see that progress. I'm sorry. Oh, so I started the changing of the seasons crochet along. I'm only finished with day three. <laughs> But this is what I got so far. And I crochet, I do not knit. I might try it later, but so far, not very good. But here's, and I only got the, the mild, I think it was. And then here's the other two. And, and I think that's all the colors. Yeah, I only got the mild. I'm going to buy the others as I need them. I've got to do more crochet though. I have to. And I'm keeping this in a Happy Planner bag. I got this on clearance from Happy Planner. So that's always good. Clearance is always good. I'm sorry. This week, let's see. What have I spent? Nothing! Um, I've done really good this week. The Friday night fight night was the last thing I bought. So, otherwise I haven't. Spending money on cross stitching or crocheting or, or sewing, nothing. So I did real good. I do have some things that I need, so I will have to buy them soon, but I'm trying to earn up the gift cards to cover it so it don't count against my budget. Because gift cards to me is free money. <sighs> and that's it. I'm hoping this week to get a big chunk of this out. Because I want to finish this. I have to finish it for Aiden. And the saddest thing is already found another one that I want to do. And I know my daughter is going to have another baby sooner or later. So I'm thinking of going ahead and getting the blanket and just starting on it now so I don't have to be so rushed because I'm sorry, I don't like being rushed. But yeah, I'm going to pick out another one. Well, I already picked it out. I got to get it, though. And these are gifts. So I might save up the gift cards for these, for this, for another one of this. I need it. I need, I need to get it, though. I really need to get it. So, because I am one of those firm believers when there's the data, there is a burst. So, yeah. And there was a death. So I feel like a birth is coming. But, oh well. This week my goal is to get Magical Stitches 1200 on the quilt. And to finish part three of the Dark Queen. Now they just released part six. So if I get finished with part three, Three, that means I'm only three parts behind. So I'm making good progress. But <laughs> I've got so many other things to do. So many other things. So we'll see. <laughs> Maybe next week I'll do something else like an ornament or for Whipgo, I need to do one more ornament to finish off last month's. And I didn't get them done because I was sick. And then for this month, it's a thousand stitches and my 
salmon, kitty, and three FFOs. Well, if I get this done, this is one FFO. I've already got one ornament that needs to be FFO'd. So if I sew one more ornament, I might do that this weekend. If I cross stitch one more ornament, that would be my three. And that would finish January's whip go, which I'm late. I know, I'm sorry, but I was sick in the dust. But then I could finish and that'd be the block for the whip go. Then I just got a thousand stitches on my salmon kitty and owl, which I did get a few in my owl last month. When I was sick, I was trying to cross stitch and it is sad when you do normally 300 to 700 stitches a day and it takes you hours to get 52 stitches in. That's how sick I was. I could not do it. So I put it up, but I need to get busy on it. So that's my plans for this week. That's what I've done for last week and my happy mail. And y'all give me your opinions now. Four Bellatrix. Top or bottom? Y'all tell me. Tell me which one. I like both. They're both so pretty. But uh, I want to start this soon. I want to start so many things soon. So, what month is it that everybody does the starts? Is that May? That's coming up soon. Or is it March? I don't know. But, I know I heard about it. And they start something new every day. Might not start something new every day. It might start something new every week and then work on a different project every day. And I also saw one for, what was that? I forget, but it was for March and uh, every day has a different prompt. I might do that one because that would get 30 different projects possibly. And hopefully I'll be done with that quilt. I'm ready to be done with it. I'm tired of working on it. I'm burned out on it. It's taken me way too long. But once it's done, it's going to be so pretty. It's going to be so pretty. I'm going to work on it today. Bella. <laughs> okay. Well, I hope everyone has a blessed day. And I'll see you next week. Thank <laughs> you.